At a time when the Columbus Division of Police are looking to hire officers, they promote several, including many command staff members. Last year, the city offered a buyout, $200,000 to 100 commanders on down to leave the division. At the time, Mayor Ginther said the program was to make room for new leadership. The folks that got promoted today are going to be influenced in the division of police for a generation, so it's really exciting to see. Friday, 32 members were promoted to sergeant, lieutenant commander, and deputy chief. Oh, this is so exciting. Exciting times for the department. We're getting the opportunity to be able to infuse some new leadership, so we're very excited about what's to come. The city currently has about 150 fewer sworn members than it is authorized to have on the division. And what does it mean promoting this many people when the division is down so many others? So what we did is we didn't actually promote to the level in which we're down. We promoted to what we need to be able to run our department efficiently. Now well and faithfully discharged. At 36, Tim Myers was sworn in as the youngest deputy chief in the division's history, beating out fellow new deputy chief Nick Convis by one year. There's a lot of pressure to that because uh, if I'm successful in uh, shepherding change and leading officers, then it's great. But uh, if I'm not, well, you know, then that's going to be pointed out as a negative. So no pressure. Myers recently returned from serving overseas as a judge advocate in the Army. He's a board member of the Starfish assignment and will oversee the Patrol South subdivision. He says he's excited for the new challenge in leadership. It's a ton of opportunity for us to make some progress. Uh, to um, make sure that we're on the right track and to innovate and uh, see if there's a better way we can uh, serve the community. And Chief Bryant tells me she'll have more to come soon on how she's planning on filling those gaps. In Columbus, Lacey Crisp, 10TV News.